How's it going guys? Welcome back to another tutorial. Lovely bit of rain outside at the moment. It's actually quite blissful. Today I want to show you how you can solve pretty much any easy anti-cheat issue which is relating to a game not being able to launch, a game failing to launch or anything which looks like this essentially. So unrecognized game client is the biggest one. You also have um, couldn't start the game, you know there's a problem, here's another problem, here's another problem. Problem. For something called easy anti-cheat, it's really not fucking easy. Now for this, I'm going to be assuming that it's a particular game which isn't loading and I'm going to use the great example of Fortnite. Fortnite for me consistently breaks. So what you want to do is open your file explorer and you want to go and find wherever Fortnite is installed to. If you don't know where your Fortnite is installed to, open Epic Games. Click on your library on the left, find Fortnite and click these three little dots just in the bottom right and then go to manage and right down at the bottom where it says installation there's a little folder icon and if you click this it will take you to exactly where your game is installed. Once you've found your Fortnite folder what you want to do is click on Fortnite game, go into binaries, win64 and then there should be a folder called Easy Anti Cheat. Now you want to hop in here and you want to find this little bastard right here, Easy Anti Cheat underscore setup dot exe. Give this a tickle, open this, don't be afraid of it. And it'll open this little menu right about here. And you might have seen this before when you've actually been installing games. Don't worry about changing the drop down menu. All you want to do is click on the repair service button and it will take two seconds if that doesn't take long at all and then you want to click finish you do have to restart your computer um, it will not work if you have not restarted and from here your game should work just fine one thing to bear in mind is that usually when fortnite gets updated this issue will um, reoccur it will happen again i also have it as well where say for example i um, update battlefield 2042 which also uses easy anti-cheat then that will break fortnite somehow they're all connected and to be honest with you, it baffles me. I truly don't understand it. But this is not a permanent fix, unfortunately. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Hope it helped. And if it did, leave a like on it. Thank you.